and then that's how they use it. So then, and then now sometimes there is no definition necessary and sufficient criteria for meditation that has achieved widespread acceptance with the modern scientific community. Now, some science studies have done meditation and they have shown that this stuff helps with calming the body down. They've actually seen it how it works with the nervous system, the blood, and so forth. So they have, they actually have proved, where well, Reiki hasn't been proved to work scientifically, but they actually have proved meditation works. The separation of technique from tradition, this is where the cause of meditation has happened a lot. So some difficulties in precise meditation have been recognised the particularities of many various traditions. Um, most people say, such as faith as Hindu or Buddhist schools, and individuals may teach distinct types of meditation. So every meditation for different things are done. That's why they have certain mantras. So they'll have like a mantra for um, Ganesh or Krishna to remove block, um, blockages, or you use um, um, Gayatri for for, for um, removing bad luck, or you use Lakshmi, which you use to create wealth. So there's all these different win ideas of it. And then everybody, every school has a different idea. So the other idea is, well, we can look at is the different types of idea of this. The Buddhist uh, tradition um, divides meditation and practice into Samantha, which is, um, Samantha is the serenity, tranquility or awareness. And then for Pashna, you may have heard, the Pashna is also something where people go for 30 days and they sit in silence for 30 days and then they don't, they're only allowed to do is 